every morning I wake up and I look like if our be building hasn't been bombed yet, completely destroyed. Well, on Thursday, 24th of February, I woke up very early because like I had to take my driving test and celebrate an anniversary with my boyfriend. And then like I got up and I started to hear like bomb explosions. And like my parents said, like the war has started. He like invaded Ukraine and we have to go. And uh, I traveled from Kyiv. It took us two days to get from Kyiv to the southwestern part of Ukraine. I managed to cross the border with Romania, with my family. So, you know, at the border, it was like really tough because there were like boyfriends who said goodbye to their girlfriends, like the fathers who said goodbye to their children. So we're here now, but like my father is there still. I have many, many relatives, like all over Ukraine, friends uh, who are like in the territorial defense right now. Well, it was great, you know, I, I, I was taking a gap year. I just like a few weeks ago, I finished uh, sending out my applications to like different universities in United Kingdom, in United States. Right now, uh, I have many friends in Kharkiv where they like destroyed hundreds of civilians buildings right now. And I just heard from my friends that they destroyed like one of like really good uh, restaurants in Kharkiv and like just a week ago I thought oh I'm gonna go to Kharkiv soon and I'm gonna have breakfast there with my friends and right now like this building is completely destroyed and people are killed. My little brother like he is like so stressed because like he has to go to the air shelter every night like 10 times a night and like every time he goes to another room, he asks if there are gonna be explosions there. I really believe in Ukrainian army and people like united more than ever, I believe right now. And like no one is going to give up. 